Chirality is a geometric property of organic compound due to the presence of chiral center. Now you will think that what is chiral center? So chiral center is a structure, feature and a molecule which is responsible for its chirality. So it means that chiral center is responsible for geometric structure for chirality or for geometric property. Chiral atom is the atom in a molecule which has four groups or atom attached to in a two chiral center. So basically if we take the example of carbon, so a carbon atom which is bonded to four different groups which is known as chiral carbon atoms or asymmetric carbon atoms. Now the groups which attach to carbon atom may be same or may be different, may be symmetric or may be asymmetric. So it gives us the geometric property. So this property is known as chirality. So on the base of chirality, we have divided the molecules into two types. The first one we have is chiral molecule and the second one is a chiral molecule. The first one we have chiral molecule. Chiral molecule is also known as asymmetric molecule. Asymmetric. Why it is known as asymmetric molecule? Because this molecule cannot divide it into two equal parts. For example, lactic acid. This we have the example of lactic acid. So this molecule cannot divide into two equal parts. Parts. If we take the, any type of proportion like this, like this, um, and the other way around like this or this, but it cannot divide equally. So such type of molecule is known as chiral molecule. The second type we have a chiral molecule. A chiral molecule is also known as symmetric molecule. It is opposite to that of chiral. It is also known as symmetric because such molecule can be divided into two equal parts. For example, we have this example of methane. So methane can easily divide into two equal parts. If we divide in this proportion or in this proportion. So it can divide into two equal parts. Now some point should be noted that some molecules not have chiral atom but still chiral. How? If we take this example, so here we have two carbon, to each carbon three bromine is attached and to other carbon three iodine is attached. So it means that this part, this carbon is achiral. Why it is achiral? Because three e same atoms are attached. And this is also achiral because three iodine is attached. So it means that it does not have chiral atom because both have a chiral but still the whole molecule is chiral why the whole molecule is chiral it the whole molecule is chiral because it cannot divide it into two equal parts that's why it is chiral now the second point is some molecule have more than one chiral but they, they are still a chiral how if we take this example so to each carbon CH3 hydrogen and bromine is attached and to other carbon CH3 bromine and hydrogen is attached. So it means that this carbon we have is basically chiral. Why it is chiral? Because it cannot divide it into two equal parts. If we take this part. So it is chiral. And this part is also chiral because different atoms are attached. But the whole molecule is a chiral. Why the whole molecule is a chiral? Because it can divide it into two equal parts. If we divide it in this way, so it, we will get two equal halves. So it was a little bit about chirality and chiral center. Thanks for watching.